Alexa, shut down. Alexa, stop. Hey, I don't know the right words. What can I tell you, man? It's like a modern situation for me. You know, I got this. You know, don't worry about that part. You know, I changed my um, my setting once again. Tell you the truth, um, when I think about it, in Africa, I'm setting up right, my office right by my bedroom. I can see my bed, you know. And I'm in uh, when I was at my sister's house. When I met my sister's house, Virginia. It's set up right in the same place where I see the, the bed that I sleep in. When I'm in um, when I'm in New York with my uh, fraternity brother's place. I'm uh, uh, I'm in his office, but uh, I actually sleep on the floor and on a on a mat on the floor, you know. So I guess it's appropriate that when I'm at my best friend's house here in uh, St. Louis, well, <laughs> there's my bed right there. Of course, you can't see it. So it's a new setting, but you see, I'm sort of like a uh, this is a plain of oat oat milk. Chocolate. I like chocolate. Anyway, um, here they have all have all. You know, they, they, he's got like uh, you know the, 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 the Alexa thing in every room. You know, you got uh, where you got you got HBO, Amazon Prime, but whatever they got, and Netflix. In fact, I watched Netflix the other day. I saw the Dave Chappelle. Thing that everybody seems to be all in a tizzy about. <laughs> you know, uh, James Baldwin once said a long time ago um, that uh, the poets were the people that basically, I'm paraphrasing, douse the flames. You know, you, know, you can get your, you know, you're all dazzled by a light and the poets come over and say, ah, you know, then you gotta like, look for some more light, something like that. Well, in this day and age, it's the comedians. You know, but I'm a, I'm this type of person uh, when, when I write. Right, they tell me I write very very visually. You know, mm, I guess because it comes from a poet thing. Eh, I don't know about that. Well, whatever, whatever. whatever. Um, but when, but I'm really a sound person. You know, I'm mean, like sound. That's why I changed the thing because I didn't like the sound of upstairs. I didn't like it. You know, so I'm, hopefully the sound is going to be better. Anyway, but what I also am, uh, in, in sort of visual person, I. I in literature, I can read. I read between the lines. That sort of got me out of South Bronx. Let's call it that. And even in, when I'm watching film, like my favorite form of film was a thing called kinetic art. So I found this when I was in the Air Force, and they showed this thing. And they came in. It's like scratchy things, whatever have you. And somebody came, and they were sort of. I don't know, testing us. There's about maybe five, six of us in the room, and they were, and every time they would go and show it, right? Everybody would be guessing. Then they would come to. I'd be the last person. I would say blah 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 blah. I was correct each and every time. So I have some sort of weird ability in terms of like visuals, you know, to um, to see stuff, you know. So anyway, uh, I, I did a, a video a while ago uh, with, with the Jay-Z, you know, uh, um, football thing. And I mentioned anybody's name, but the visuals struck me and I did the whole thing on the visuals. When I listened back to it, I said, ooh, that's deep. I didn't mention any names. There's the visuals, but the visuals said it, everything. The Chappelle show, quite in with the Chappelle, not, not Chappelle show, but the, the flicks of sticks and stones, something like that. Quite interesting. Now you all listen to what he's saying. Yeah, yeah, you listen to what he's saying. But I'm looking at something else. You see, I'm wearing my uh, this is jumpsuit. This is a, it's a worker suit uh, that uh, in Alice we have a thing. You know, Etikani. See, uh, Etikani is the what's the name for Alice? You know, the, the, the Europeans came and they planted a flag and they call it hey. Princess Alice, whoever, Queen Alice, whoever she was, we'll call this place Alice. The locals say, no, the place is called Eddie Kenny. And then, uh, well, anyway, the point is, uh, this is an initiative, and you all seen this before, maybe you didn't see it before, it's just Alice, whatever. And then back it has all, wait, let me show you this. See all those names back there, Eddie Kenny? That's all, hopefully you can see it. That's all the villages around us, a lot of them, aren't they? And I live in one of the villages of Salamanzi, but in the Lembete area of Salamanzi. Uh, anyway, uh, but the, but, but I, I like I like this outfit. I'm going to get another one, a black one next year. I guess we're going to go back because uh, hopefully they'll be making them again. Um, but this is a workers thing. They put, workers put it over your, your stuff, like I have something over there. And I noticed something with Chappelle. Uh, 
if you look at his uh, thing on, I think it's on, yeah, on this side, he has his name, Chappelle. Well, here, here's the patch, like that, you know, a C patch. I don't think you'll get it. <laughs> First of all, you can say it's a worker's uniform, but if you put the name like that, it could be a worker's. But also, that's what the military does. I was in the military, I believe this is the way it was. My name is here, Sloan here, and here is the United States Air Force. Then you have, you might have patches, whatever, like a, this is a patch here. This is my fraternity patch right here. So this, I might get a fraternity patch and put it on this thing right here if I was have, have a thing like that. But the point is, we're all in a war footing. And they, without saying it, is a warrior. On his special, Sticks and Stones, and I think it's wore some other times too. That's his uniform. That's his war uniform. Beyond, uh, well, well, we have a natural uniform, black. You know, everybody's after black men. So, so you can't, that's a uniform. You can't get away from that. Every black man think they're going to become something else, whatever they think they're going to become. Uh, a, a rich person, a, a bouye, a, 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 a transsexual, homosexual, whatever have you. Beyond all that, still black. That's your first uniform. Everything else that you put on, it's everything else. So you can take on the uh, the the uniform of a, of a of a of a capitalist. I mean, in your in your in your mind, you know what I mean. But you shout out to Byron Allen doing the war thing as a capitalist. You could be a, 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 a transsexual, but you're still and you got a war as a well. You could war as a transsexual, but guess what? You can be a lesbian. You could. They'll go to war as a, you know, go, go speak up for lesbians or whatever it is, but you can't get away from that. Your first and foremost, everything you put on over that, or even in your head, the way the world is, the way it's developed, it's secondary. First, your that's just a little message for me. T from the Pattersons, taking a train to Tibet, working out of my new setting, letting you know what I only suspect. <laughs>